Do you see that happening? Is there going to be subpoena power given to investigate this to a special select committee? Well, I hope so. We have never heard from many of the key players uh, that were involved in that, including Ben Rhodes, who we now see is <laughs> used to be spokesperson for the NSC, obviously was the political uh, hack for, <laughs> for the Obama reelect. You've got to understand this in the context of the Obama reelect campaign. The uh, tide of war is receding. Well, Susan Rice said uh, Al Qaeda has been decimated. Remember that? That the embassy was stable and secure. This was all in line with a reelection campaign rather than the facts surrounding the tragic deaths of four brave Americans. That's what's outrageous about this. I think a lot of people uh, would agree with that. And I would look at it and say in the middle of a presidential election, uh, it was, you know, and I hope this doesn't come out the wrong way, but it was, it was an opportunity, you know, to, to be presidential, to show the leadership, to show what happens when America is attacked, to show what your response would be, uh, to show how tough you can be in these situations. No? Well, that's exactly what Mr. Rhodes said was their, pri their highest priority, was to uh, shore up the image of the President of the United States as a strong uh, a warrior who is uh, the tide of, of al-Qaeda is decimated, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. And that's what's so outrageous about this. In, in addition, it's the cover-up. And there was ample evidence, including, by the way, the survivors who were flown out the next day. And then put it in this context, Martha, two weeks later, the President of the United States goes to the United Nations and says, hateful videos, uh, spontaneous demonstrations, etc. At that time, there was overwhelming evidence that that was not the case. And then, of course, the, the famous exchange with Romney where the uh, so-called moderator then uh, authenticated his uh, allegation that he had condemned it as a terrorist attack, which was patently false. Understood. Senator, uh, we're going to leave it there. Thank you so much. I hope you'll come back. We want to talk about the veteran situation.